I'd like to ask you about the, the new series that you're going to be doing for, for DC. It's fascinating to me. I'd like to know how you came about choosing the characters that you guys are going to be focusing on. Well, some of the characters, we're still trying to figure out how many, who's going to be involved. But really, to me, it's trying to have a representation of the characters who, for me, when I was growing up, when they arrived, I really felt the difference. I really felt that they stood out. You know, obviously, Black Lightning, Jon Stewart, Vixen, uh, Katana, uh, Rene Montoya. I love that you put Rene Montoya, somebody from the ground of the yeah. DC Universe, in there as well. But her transition, you know, from being someone, as you say, on the ground to becoming a hero, uh, and a hero to me, the question has always been one of the most fascinating heroes. But what what can we do to try to make sure that we not just represent in terms of one from this column or one from that column, but from their perspectives, the points of views, the powers that they have, the limitations that they feel sometimes, um, how one person may have inspired the other, um, that sense in life that sometimes you really are passing the baton or passing the torch. Uh, how can we tell this story where, like life, um, you see the connectivity, you see how history evolves over time, and who are these individuals who are going to bring the audience with it. So it's really exciting to know that you can take almost any character in the DC Universe yeah. and individuals who, unfortunately, sometimes, in my opinion, over history, they felt like maybe they were sidelined or they weren't really there, and saying, no, they were there, they were part of history, and in fact helped create that history and that mythology that so many people enjoy today. How long have you been thinking about this uh, story, and when did you pitch it? You know, to be to a degree, honestly, uh, in, in my life as a comic book reader, I've always thought about it, where there are moments where something happens, again, much as in life, and you think, well, what did that mean, or what were they really saying, or why didn't that character uh, get to be part of the team, or, you know, why was Vixen, why was her rollout, you know, delayed several years? Now, part of that was actually uh, financial reasons, but in story, when you think about it, you know, a black woman who's, uh, the fact that uh, her existence was, you know, was pushed back a little bit you know for a writer there's a little bit of a story there and there's a little bit of thought so I don't want to say like oh my god I've been writing this for years but as someone who's read stories enjoyed stories there was always a little imagination that was going on for me with the stories that were presented and it's great to have this opportunity decades later to try to take some of those things that I thought or I felt and put them into action